morning to my dear friends. How are you? This is day number two at PBE, the Tranquility Diaper Manufacturer. This is the coolest thing. I am so honored to be here. So I am going to fix my hair while I chat with you and tell you what we're going to do today. I'm going to be touring the, the factory where they actually make the products. I'm going to be in a meeting, a production meeting. So the production team would be the people that are actually on the assembly line putting together these products. And then I get to greet them and say hello. And I'm excited about that because they are the ones <clears throat> that matter. Everybody matters, but they're the ones putting in the sweat and tears to make sure that these products are put together so that we can purchase them. And I'm going to be in a round table, on a round table panel. I don't remember exactly who's in that meeting. And then I'm going to, I get to, I can't video inside the factory, but I get to video outside. They have three buildings there. One is offices. And then the far one is the fact, or is the um, the warehouse where they store stuff. And then the one in between is the actual plant. And I get to, they have this really pretty rose bush. I'm gonna make sure I show you. I love flowers and I love roses. There's a really pretty rose bush out front that I'm gonna show you. My plane leaves about 3.30 today. And, um, I get to do a little bit of video today, so you're gonna see a little bit of video that I'm doing. And I need the hairspring. So I don't know that I have anything too interesting to tell you today. Oh, I was going to tell you something funny about my coffee. This is a little Keurig thing right behind me. These little coffee machines are usually really, really hot. This is my second cup of coffee. The first cup of coffee that I drank was, I would say, just above lukewarm. And I thought, wow, this is really weird. Who's ever heard of that before? So I went ahead and drank it, and I thought, well, I'm going to make another one, and I'm going to test this out. And then if this one is also lukewarm, then I'm going to tell the front desk that there's something wrong with the temperature setting that they have in their Keurig machine. And I made the second cup, and the second cup was as hot as it was supposed to be. Well, the first cup, when I first tried to make it, I didn't put any water in there. I saw the thing where you put the water in, but I thought, well... Maybe this is one of those those um, those machines you don't have to put water in. You know, everything's so automated. Why not automate the Keurig machine, right? Well, turns out you really do have to put water in it if you want to get any kind of tea. So I did get the water in. The stories... of the few employees that I have met is really, really sweet. And I need something else for my hair. Sweet might not be the right word. It's very endearing. It's very special. You don't hear a lot of companies that have such longevity. I think they told me that with their 220 plus employees, they have something like 1,400 years of service that's a that's a experience that's a lot of years and a lot of experience okay this is a donut and you just it's made out of nylon and you just put it in your hair you can use it in different ways and i'm just going to put it right over my ponytail i kind of have an idea of what i'm wanting to do with my hair today kind of so this is the end of my most spectacular special visit.
This is Chuck and this is Carol. Carol, and they own this whole PBE company. They're the CEO, and they gave me this right here to take home, and this is very special. Can you explain this? Yes, it's it's all about uh, parents who are caring for a child, and uh, so we we honor those who are caregivers, and this is a symbol of our relationship and the relationship we love to have with all those who care about other people uh, using our product or in whatever way they're involved in caring. So Great. And Chuck, would you like to say Thank something to Micah much. real quick? Hi, Micah. Mike. We have had such fun with your mom. <laughs> <laughs> so we're glad you let her out of the house. Yeah. It was so sweet. So oh, we had, thank you. And, Great. And Brian here is... He's the man who makes it all happen. You know, without him, yeah, nothing, nothing really moves here. So we're yeah. so grateful. All right. Thank you for coming. Thank you so much for having me. Good. Can you say no, I can just say hi and goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank Thanks, you. everybody. All right. I love roses, and look how pretty these are. And they've got a beautiful flag out here. So this is just walking around to the side of the building, the side of the business building. And look, they've got. They can fish, I think, twice a month out here, and I forget what they stock in here. But they get to watch out their window. And look at those, do I have them in the camera? Those ducks. No, they're geese. Can you see those way over there? They just had babies a couple of weeks ago. So sweet. Are those geese out there? Yes. Okay, I got it right. Geese. We used to have two bald eagles, but they're not there today. Yeah, we didn't get to see any bald eagles. Okay, so this this is the business office building. This is where I've been in. Mostly. Okay, and then the middle, middle building, the white building over there, that's production, right? That's the manufacturing's in the center. And then the is the production uh, offices. Oh, so manufacturing is this brown building. Warehouses on the far side. And then there's production, and then on the far end is the warehouse. And we're walking toward a lending library. We'll get closer. Okay, no, go ahead and talk. So our free little library up here. Yeah. There's a website. And you can go on that and find them all across the country. And so this, this would show up and it's just a... Uh, that is just the coolest thing I've never heard I guess of. I I called it wrong. It's the Little Free Library. It's www.littlefreelibrary.org. Isn't that cool? And you can share books with each other. And you just open it. And there's books in there. Isn't that cool? So I have toured in this building. This is where the factory is. And this is it, and we're headed to the airport. Anyway, I just wanted to thank Tamara for coming to visit us here at PBE, and a special thank you to Micah. I feel like I know you. I look Aww. forward to Micah Monday, and you're an inspiration to all of us. And uh, we don't want to be known as just a diaper factory. We want to be known as changing people's lives. and. We appreciate you sharing your story, and we are so grateful that you opened your door for us to walk in. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. Now tell us about this over here. Oh, this is uh, honors uh, Lee and Jim Mitchell. They're the founders of Principal Business Enterprises. They're Carol's parents. And we just met Carol in the video. Carol and Chuck Stocking. Carol and Chuck Stocking. Our lunch that was so kindly packed for us to eat on the road. The airport's like an hour from here. And we have a, is that a grilled chicken? Looks like a grilled chicken sandwich. A grilled chicken sandwich with a cookie. Everybody needs cookie with a grilled cheese sandwich. Cherry apple crunch, that looks really good. And that's mayonnaise. And then there's the tomato and the lettuce. And oven baked barbecue. Oven baked original, and Janet said she didn't care, so I told her I would try the barbecue. 
So this concludes our trip. Thank you so much for being here. This is Tamara Weeks with Tam's Daily Vlog. I will look to the hills from whence cometh my help, for my help cometh from the Lord. And I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Okay, we are going into the Detroit airport. Oh, the Detroit airport is new? Yeah, it's newer. They used to have an older one, and now they just built this new terminal. Oh, wow. Yeah. We are landing in Omaha right now. Isn't it so cool to see what it looks like from above to look at the ground? Because when you're on the ground, you can't tell how perfect everything really is. When you look at it up above, you can see everything's in squares. Isn't that cool? You see that wiggling part right there in the middle? It's water and there's trees around there. If you can hear the guy behind me, he's giving commentary about what we're looking at. How farmers create these breaks. Shadow of the plane we're in right there. Oh, that's cool. 